Hello Librans, welcome to your horoscope for July 2021. Um, I will start with the astrology. So on the 12th of July we've got Mercury which goes into your 10th house. So this could be good for like starting a new job or starting new contracts, um, communications. I feel like some of you guys might do a big presentation. It would be really good for those sort of things. The 22nd of July, Venus will go into your 12th house. Um, so this is, um, the 12th house is a funny house. It's um, It has some institutions and secrets. Um, so it can be like health. That's why I feel like that can be quite good for like health issues coming in for you. On the 28th, you got Mercury going into your 11th house. So this could be good for like with friends, um, going out, having fun, or, or just sorting things out with friends in terms of um, communications and discussions. On the 29th, you got Jupiter, which is going to retrograde back into your fifth house, so house of relationships and children. So good with um with people in relationships or finding someone new. Um, good get along with your children better as well, or trying for children or babies. On the 30th, you got Mars, which is going into that 12th house, um, which can be bring like can be health um, or secret school. Maybe I feel like. There could be a secret that becomes an argument, something about to do with a secret, but an argument can come up. Okay, now when I look at your cards, um, Librans, have a look here. I do get money coming in for you. Okay, what next? All right, so I've got money coming in, but then I've got this card coming in. I feel like this is to do with work, so I do feel like more like um, money or could it be it could it could be a payout coming in? It's like unexpected, but not unexpected that this is going to be coming into you, um, and you're kind of feeling a bit sad about it, almost like you're feeling a bit bit poor, um, even though you're getting this this money that's coming in um, for you. But there's always something better coming up. So I just feel like that even though this door at the moment doesn't feel like it's that great, it's it's not feeling good, it's a bit miserable, but there are some good things coming up out of it, um, whether it be new opportunities that are coming. Things are blossoming up for you in the background. You just can't see it yet. Um, just like in the card, you've got this lady here who's looking a bit, bit sad, a bit miserable, but the flowers standing out to me. Um, it's also about setting your ground at work. I feel like this is all about work. you got to stand your ground at work as well um, with what's coming up here. I feel like there's a lot of a lot of arguments, bullying. There's things not going the right way. It, it's, it's um, you're a bit worried to, there's a, there's a shake up coming where you are working. I feel like there's a big shake up coming where you are. Um, I do feel like this is unexpected. I feel like people are standing up for themselves at work, could, which could be you. Um, and I do feel like a new beginning could possibly be coming in for with all this with you. Now, with relationships, um, I feel like some of you, there has been a bit of emotional stuff going on here with relationships as well. Your heart has been very guarded. Um, however, this is a good month to go out and to have fun and to meet meet people and socialize. I do feel like it's going to be a month of love coming for some of you for this month. Um, it's not without some emotion coming in, some emotional clashing and a bit of a, I'm going to say a little bit of drama going on, but I feel like it's more positive than negative when it comes to relationships and, and going out and having fun um, for this month for you. When we look at friends, Mm, let's have a look here. I do feel like you might be leaving some friends, uh, friend behind, um, or, or or moving on to something else. Or it's just something about moving on. It's it's murky water, so you can't really see it yet. You can't really see what's happening around you with it, but you are going on to perhaps meeting new people. Um, leaving old friends behind, perhaps. With that one, it's like it's like it's all murky. You can't really see what's actually happening. You're just going in a new, new direction. Um, however, there is someone with you, so I do feel like there's a friend that's going in with you in this in this path that you're taking. Um, now, when we're looking at money for you, 
I wouldn't have worried. I know you're going to be worried this month about money. Um, money's coming a lot up for you. I also feel like there's someone around you at work. I don't, I'm not going back to work, but there's someone around you who's a bit of a nitpicker, OCD. Um, they like things a certain way. They're a bit perfectionist. And just, I... Uh, there is news coming of money. So there is the news coming. It, you are going to feel it, but I feel like you get you, like you're going to be okay. By September, everything will sort of start opening, working itself out for you. Um, look at family for you. Hmm. I do feel like there might be some arguments or fighting with brothers and sisters, brothers, brothers and sisters. Or like, well, someone's guarding something. They're not. They're not saying everything that they know, um, and you want them to. So I feel like there could be some arguments coming up with that. In terms of the whole family, I am getting it uh, quite, quite peaceful. Um, it's like you're the matriarch. You're the, the head of the person, and everyone else is following you. And I feel like this month is going to be okay there with family. I just feel like you're worrying over money. Just, I just really feel like there's a big sense of worrying. General health I feel like is good, but there's a big sense of worrying about money this month for you. Okay. See what else I can get for you, Librans? Okay. <clears throat> Librans. It is time for you to start looking at a different way. There's a new thing coming into your life. This new thing's coming that you have wanted for a long time. It is finally here. It's a new step up where you're going to go in this direction of fun, where you're no longer going to be bullied, no longer going to be the person that's the odd one out, where you're going to have to put up with people's distreatments of you. This time it's going to be about going into... A nicer place where people are treating you right and with respect and they are being nice to you just as you've always wanted difference it is also going to be a month of hustle and bustle but knowing where you sit in your place with your family family, mem family members around you have going to you for advice and they're wanting to know an outcome of a situation where you're not sure of possibly could be people moving on in family going on to new places and new, and new things there is a lot of run around you who is not doing the best. There's like they're in two minds. They're here or there, but they will come. They they will decide to go on to a better place this month as well. Stay true to yourself. Stay true to your thoughts, and know that things are always going to work out. Thank you, Librans. I am on TikTok now. Um, so if you want to follow me on TikTok, it is Lady D Psychic on TikTok. I will put it down in the description box. Um, I was going to do to be in Brisbane for the MBS up there. However, I'm in Sydney and they've now closed the borders to people in Sydney. I will now be in Sydney MBS in October and hopefully I'll get to Brisbane next year. Um, and I might have more announcements coming up or soon, which I'll be putting up my Facebook and Instagram um, as well. And thank you for liking, sharing your comments, and I will see you for your horoscope for next month. So bye for now.